we are here today to launch uh, smart energy systems uh, as a pilot scheme we are within KTD system uh, and we are happy that uh, this particular system and pilot scheme has been sponsored by the Germans in partnership with the Chinese. <laughs> One of the key partnerships we have is with KTDA, um, together with ETP and FAO. We're implementing a triangular partnership project between China, Kenya and Germany, um, focusing on low carbon tea value chains here in Kenya. It is a pilot scheme in terms of energy savings. Uh, and you all know that uh, energy savings is actually money. Uh, we spend a lot of uh, money in the energy in terms of withering for our factory. And today we are in Kiru Tea Factory uh, to launch a program uh, that um, we call smart energy management system that would help us address issues of cost. That means that the farmer, if we are able to manage the cost through energy efficiencies, then that is um, a gain to the farmer. So we started to look at how can we introduce measures to save energy and reduce costs in the factories, in the tea factories, that eventually trickle down to the farmers that are getting paid bigger bonuses because there's more savings. So this system we are calling boiler monitoring system is uh, one of a kind. We've never installed one in any KTDA factories. And uh, this is a progression from where we've been operating. We had to start automating our data collection in our boiler operations away from what we've been doing, which is manual. It's very tedious to to use the data and it's not user friendly. We normally measure volume of firewood in cubic meters, but that is uh, not very accurate way of uh, measuring uh, the fuel. The best way to measure is mass. And this system is going to allow us to measure the uh, kilos of uh, biomass that we use, whether firewood or briquettes or any form of biomass that we use. We'll also be able to measure steam generated by the boilers, which currently we are not able to do, but this system will enable us to measure those ones. We're also going to be able to measure pressure and uh, save the data online that can be accessed by the management of the factory and can be transmitted and even make it easy to analyze and make decisions on the operation of the factory. Uh, and secondly, also, we are looking at issues of uh, you know, uh, sustainability, emissions, carbon emissions, um, and one of the things that we are doing as an organization is uh, decarbonizing our operations across uh, the T-value chain. We've worked in different ways, offering trainings in the factories, uh, implementing measures, and um, as a next step to all of this, we're now looking at low carbon tea value chains because a lot of the um, energy use in the tea factories is linked to greenhouse gas emissions. So we are particularly happy that uh, the scheme has, has been launched today and they will run until we find out whether it's beneficial to the farmer. We hope the Palo scheme will justify uh, the investment that has come in uh, in this policy scheme. Mm -hmm.